CataractCoach.com, Rosatelli Double Capsular Rexis, successful surgery for this intumescent white cataract. Look at this milky thing. Now, we all know Neto Rosatelli. He's our favorite surgeon to watch online. He's so incredible. Here we go. We have a tough case here of an intumescent cataract. Got some tripen blue dye going in. Here comes your viscoelastic. And we need to get a rectus done here. So what we're going to do first is a double rectus. So poking in here. Let's see. Do we get any milk? Nah, maybe a little bit. But starting off with just a first small baby rectus. Now, why? Well, because the rectus has no edges that are going to run out. And from this, we can decompress the bag. So here, completing that baby rexus, there's the first rexus. And now, to decompress it, what are you going to do? You can rotate it. You can push on it. There's some milk coming out. See that? But what Neto is going to do is he's just going to use some uh, vacuum from the phaco probe and really decompress the bag, going under that rexus a little bit, rotating the lens, tapping on the center of it, making sure you really get all that intumescent fluid out. The milky stuff has to come out. You've got to milk this baby. Now, once you've done that, now you can enlarge the rectus. So again, rotating this lens and then getting that milk out and again, tapping on it, tilting it side to side to make sure you get out the liquefied lens cortex that's behind the nucleus too. Now, while we're doing that, let me tell you about Retinarounds, retinarounds.com, our favorite sister channel. So amazing. I promise you're going to love it. You're going to learn so much. Can I quit telling you about it? Can you just go and check it out? Now, here we go. Enlarging this now. And so poking in there and enlarging. Now this is the exact rexus you want. This is the five millimeter rexus. And you can see Neto's using these forceps also that have marks of two and a half and five millimeters, just like I do. Look at that. Now Neto's an amazing surgeon and he has every surgeon's dream. He just does surgery five days a week. I mean, truly an amazing setup. And he does an incredible volume of surgery. And he has incredible skills. Now you've seen the Rosatelli spin. Here, we're not gonna do that. If you have the pentagonal shape, here's a new phaco tip that he's been using. And it's going to help kind of cut through this denser nucleus pretty easily. So the shape is not round at the tip, it's rather it's pentagonal. So when you get that torsional rotational phaco movement or ultrasonic energy, maybe that's going to help break it up faster. So here it comes, let's see, groove down the middle. Now you're saying, why isn't Neto doing the Neto Rossitelli spin? You know, that characteristic spin trademarked by him where you spin the nucleus so many times in both directions to loosen up lens cortex. Well, think about it. The liquefied lens cortex is already gone. There's really no cortex left in this case. And then you're saying, well, why is he doing a divide and conquer or he's doing a stop and chop? Why not a quick chop? Because a great surgeon like Neto knows all the techniques. This is why I keep telling you, you need to learn all the techniques. Okay, if you love stop and chop, great. If you love divide and conquer, great. Doesn't mean you can't learn the others. You gotta learn them all. So there's the stop and chop, two halves, now going to high vacuum, higher flow. There's the chopper, boom. Chop it in, in half. So now you got two quarters that can come up pretty easily. A little sub-chop if you need to. So a stop and chop technique. And again, a great surgeon can do all the techniques, not just one. If you're good at basketball, you can do all the plays. You can do layup, an alley-oop. You can do a slam dunk. You can do free throw. You can do three-pointer. You can do everything. Same with this. You want to be a great cataract surgeon, you got to learn it all. Now, let's take a zoom in here and take a look. Buzzing in with the FACO probe here. Look at that into the meat of the nucleus. There it is. There's that special tip. Buzzing in. Chopper goes around the equator. Pow. Easily cracked. Easily chopped. Now you have two quarters. Now you've got eights. Look at that. Chopped so effortlessly. Those can be removed very easily. So beautiful job here, Neto. Thank you, my friend, for sharing these videos. And now let's take a look here. Fun to watch a master at work. Now he is an incredible surgeon. Remember, though, we do not compete with Neto. Neto is like Superman. We can't all be Superman. I cannot be Superman. I can be an amazing surgeon, a very talented surgeon, but I can't be Superman. So Neto is Superman. So learn from Neto. Try to learn some of the techniques, but don't worry, you don't have to compete with him, I promise. Now, by the way, you should check out his YouTube channel. He has a fantastic YouTube channel. And if you happen to have those 3D glasses, he posts 3D videos all the time. Now, here you go at the end. Look at that, very little cortex remaining. You definitely need the IA probe here. So using the IA probe to clean up that cortex, a little bit of floppiness in that iris maybe. And again, this patient's gonna be so happy. Can you imagine coming in there with a white cataract, seeing almost nothing, You're gonna have this beautiful, elegant surgery done and have essentially normal vision in just a few minutes. That is just, ah, oh, I just love white cataracts. I just can never get sick of them. Here at the end of the case, let's see what we got. And looks like maybe putting just BSS in. Yeah, hydro, hydro implantation. So left hand has the infusion of uh, BSS. Right hand deliver the lens and then you just get that tucked in the bag. And then there's no more viscal out. So just seal up the main incision. 
with some hydration. Beautiful job. Thank you, Neto. Remember, check out Neto's channel on YouTube. So much great material to learn. And remember, you too can do a beautiful job just like this. Check out Rounds, our sister channel. So much great material. I promise you're going to love it. Even if you're a cat or a guy like me, you're still going to learn a lot.